Okay, I have a feeling I'm about to get into some heavy business. Am I sure I'm ready for this? I'm ready for whatever might happen. Took you long enough. It still works. Of course it still works. Auto over-engineers everything. Crawler, I, I think that's the nicest thing you've ever said about me. Otto, you're looking well fed. Ford, you sound like your old self. Well, some things are clear to me now that weren't before. But come on, there's a lot to be done. Is it really you? Cassie! Compton! And Bob. I'm... I'm... I'm happy to see all of you again. What's Nick from the mailroom doing here? That's actually Helmet Fulbear's brain in Nick's body. <gasps> I do love making a grand entrance. Sounds like Full Bear. He's in there, all right. But where have you been? Uh, you don't want to know that. I've missed you so much, Big Bear. I never thought I'd see everybody together again. Well, almost everybody. Hey, I remember this place. We used to sneak in here and fool around on the beanbags, remember? Lucy! Everybody ready? Now, this hunk of junk was made by Otto Mentalis. So, uh, there's no telling what might happen. Oh, what can I say? I was underfunded back then. But if everything goes well, we might be able to have our dear friend Lucretia back in the circle. For good. Now, you ready? Kind of. <laughs> Me too, kid.
It's a mental construct I made for Lucy, to convince her that she was your grandmother and that she lived with you. Come on, it's time to get her out of here. did you step in? I don't know. It looks like a puddle of goo. With a mask of me in it. Has anyone seen my brother? He was just standing here a second ago. Ah, uh, here he is. Oh, well, come on, Raz. It's showtime. You better play along with this, Raz. We don't want to upset the construct until we have control of the situation. I'll work on Nona. this incredible balance and act in person. <laughs> Step right up to the wheel of endangerment and behold the daring father-daughter team of Breezy and Augustus Aquato. One will live, one will die. Maybe. Crazy. Who knows? Papa, you're Only late. one way to find hey, out. Hey, Fleezy. Not now, Raz. I'm trying to get up the nerve to... Look out, Raz! Come on now. Oh, the past is waiting. Stop. Keep going. Don't cut off one of Dad's legs. I will be a... Ah, Raz, but... That's not such a nice one. You did it, my boy. You're my favorite son now. Wait, who was that? Wow, Flea Dad tells it like it is. Okay, my turn to throw knives at Dad. Not the most functional family. <laughs> but at least they're all alive. Yep. Okay, time to go. We still have two acts to get through. Bull balancing and weight lifting. He lifts weights that are, frankly, quite alarming. <laughs> Who is Donatella's favorite son? I predict it's whichever one successfully completes the nearly impossible balancing course. Come join our young 
famous performer, Queepy Aquato, in front of the carousel of chaos. Watch him lift a horse and your spirit. children to work in the circus because they're just so cute they steal the show come watch creepy aquato perform feats of strength in the carousel area and see what i mean see the strongest boy on earth creepy aquato as he lifts weights that are frankly quite alarming Children are safe. No, I will show you my little secret. Come with me to the high dive. This nugget is saying to me, take me away. So what's the secret? It's at the top of the ladder. No, no, we haven't had a high dive in the Aquato family circus for years. You know, the curse. You know, the more I think about that curse, <laughs> the more I think it's a lot of gravosknok. No, get up there. Oh no! 
What am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? Ford, our circus didn't have a quilting area. I didn't make this. I created that two-bit flea circus to make Lucy forget who she was. But it looks like she escaped. Come on, Crowley, stinky dam is over this way. What? Wow. Guess you learn a thing or two when you live with fleas. trunk tag. What's this? It's Lucy and your father. Oh, this must be one of the first real memories she formed after the astrolathe procedure. Your father was put into an orphanage after his parents were drowned. I locked Maligula away, deep in Lucy's mind to make Lucy herself again. But then I got your father out of that orphanage, buried some of his more uh, traumatic memories, and brought him to her. Why? Well, they were both all alone in the world. The only family the other had left. My sweet little Gussie. Let's keep moving. Wait, wait!
this would be a sweet picture if I didn't know everybody was under some sort of astrolathe hypnosis. I never used the astrolathe on the rest of the family. These are real memories Lucy made for herself after I was gone from her life. Good family, excellent balance, very flexible. Not afraid of heights. Not like you, big crawling. Lucy, please! <laughs> to Whispering Rock Psychic Summer Camp? You're the reason I became a Psychonaut? Well, it is even you are crazy, but you were such a nerd with those comic books. Hey, True Psychic Tales is a graphic non-fiction periodical. Some part of you knew you were living a lie. You sensed Raz's power. You thought he could help you. Oh, I don't know, Crowley. I get so confused sometimes. Usually I was happy, just sewing dance and stretching the children, telling them to stay away from the water. Then I'd feel oh, so sad. And just when I was about to figure it out, everything would start to unravel. How much I hate this place. This is it. This is where I locked up Maligula. Behind that dam. We need to unlock it and draw Maligula out into the open. Then we'll combine our powers and direct the astrolathe to blast open a pit into the deepest part of her mind. Why don't we just, you know, blast Maligula? Maligula is a part of Lucy's mind. A primitive part that may have helped her early ancestors survive. We all have our own Maligula, Rasputin. We just know how to keep it locked up down below. If you can secure the area while I keep Lucy calm, then we should be able to unlock this dam together.
just once and for all. Mm, thank you for the mental energy. I need to know what's causing that mood before I can get rid of it. Something causing this bad mood around here. Great job, Raz. Now open that locket, and we'll use the astrolabe to blast it. I need to stay here with Lucy until the last minute. I think I hear something. I need the purse tag here. I think I hear some emotion. What's that sound? I think I hear some emotional baggage here. Marona! But... But... Help me focus the astrolathe, Rasputin! Quickly! I think we made many mistakes. But now, we're gonna face them. I couldn't before. I was young, scared, and alone. But now, I'm only one of those things. Oh, he's grown. Let's hope the astrolabe can make a deep enough pit. Don't worry for it. I'll be right here beside you! <laughs> Got him, Himmel! Jackpot! Bullseye! I felt her. Maligula. I know the identity of the mole. That's incredible, Sasha. Well, I had mechanical assistance, which you didn't need. <clears throat> Agents, we have a security breach in the Green Needle Gulch. She's here. safe what happened we were you were obviously in distress so I pulled you out is that her I told you he was up to something out here with his girlfriend Maligula that's not his girlfriend you little snitch I'm his girlfriend my god! Oh yeah, funny story. That's not really Nick from the mailroom. I know that, but why? Doesn't matter. I'll take it with me when I take her.
Truman. Why did you pull me out? Ford and I were about to face Maligula. Don't worry. I'm sure you'll get your chance. 